let's do an MCAT problem. A simple circuit consists of a 12 volt battery connected in series with a two ohm resistor and a five farad capacitor. What is the charge stored on the capacitor several minutes after the circuit is closed? A 2.4 coulomb, B 10 coulomb, C 30 coulomb, or D 60 coulomb. Now this question sounds harder than it is because it involves a two ohm resistor. This kind of combination circuit can throw students on the MCAT off because they think that they have to use a more complicated formula to get the answer. The kicker here is this statement in the question stem that the charge is stored on the capacitor several minutes after the circuit is closed. This implies that enough time has elapsed for charge to accumulate in the capacitor, and so it's not really important to consider the resistor at all. We don't have to calculate that two ohm resistor in any way, shape or form. All we do is we remember the classical QVC formula, Q equals voltage times capacitance. And all we do is multiply the voltage of 12 volts in the battery and the capacitance of five farads and 12 times five is 60. So this capacitor can hold 60 coulombs of charge D. See you over at MCATBoss.com.